U.S. Army helicopters were seen approaching the building, but we've heard nothing since. Police are urging citizens to remain at home and say there is very little danger of the situation spreading outside of the cordoned area. Phil, back to you. That was Diego Rodriguez coming to us live from the police blockade downtown. Today's crisis at Armacam comes on the heels of a report that one of its vice presidents was kidnapped at gunpoint this morning on his way to work. Police are refusing to speculate as to whether the events are connected. got shut down in favor of something called Perseus, which from what I can tell is funded by DOD. I'm guessing that's where Fettel and his soldiers came from. Don't shoot! My name is Norton Mapes. I I'm an engineer. Shit, it's a civilian. Give him a comm link. Hello? Who are you people? The good guys. Are you alright? Oh sure. I'm having a hell of a time. You said you're an engineer? Can you help me get into the network? What am I, an IS lackey? Tell you what, you disable the local security system, and I'll see what I can do about the server. I can disable it remotely once I'm logged in. No, you can't. It's on a separate network. It's back that way. Why do you want us to bring down the security system anyway? Never mind why. You want my help? That's the price.
Seeing hives. Look, um, Al's Wade stopped by my office this morning. I feel a little awkward saying this, but, uh, well, I really need you to tone down the innuendo around her. It's not that I personally give a rat's ass, but the last thing we need right now is a sexual harassment case drawing unwanted attention to this task force. It's supposed to be a secret after all. Okay? Thanks, George. Just wait here.
Mm-hmm. 